Welcome back. Hopefully everyone had a nice week. Uh, weather uh, was on the nice side for the better part of the week, and it's going to stay uh, pretty nice through the course of the weekend. A little bit warmer, but still not too terribly bad. We'll have a lot of sunshine to go around. As we head into next week, we'll start to mix in some cloud cover as temperatures continue to run slightly above normal. And unfortunately, no significant rain chances, uh, at least in the short term. Hopefully we'll get some better chances uh, toward the end of that 10 day period. So we'll remain optimistic there. Let's get a check of the upper level pad. Not a whole lot going on across the deep south. A quiet pattern aloft. Uh, and as we continue to see drier air filtering into the region, keeping rain chances low and nice weather conditions in the forecast. I think we're going to have a lot of sunshine uh, sticking with us through the course of this weekend. Severe clear out there today. Not a whole lot going on, not only here locally, but a good portion of the southeast. So if you are heading out this evening, overnight tonight, no major issues out there. Power Doppler 3 is quiet, mild in the short term. We are seeing temperatures in the 70s, but eventually we'll be falling through the 60s and most of us heading for the lower 50s by tomorrow morning, although some upper 40s could be possible, especially for northern Acadiana. So not quite as chilly as the past couple of nights, uh, but still cool by tomorrow morning. Most of you probably wanting a light jacket on your way out. Otherwise, warm into the afternoon, 80 to 81 will be that projected high. Lots of sunshine. Still a comfortable day with dew points in the 40s at humidity in the 20 to 30 percent range. So not much to complain about. Light easterly winds will come in at around three to six miles per hour. Similar setup into Sunday. We're going to start out in the lower 50s. Probably a degree or two warmer though Sunday afternoon. Most of us sneaking into the lower 80s, but still we're going to be dealing with mostly sunny skies. So all things considered a pretty nice looking weekend. Winds will stay light at around three to six miles per hour. Again, if you're heading out this evening, maybe for week 10 of the high school football season, pretty nice football weather out there. Nice conditions by kickoff. We'll see readings in the mid 60s and then eventually temperatures dropping into the upper 50s by the end of the game. Again, with most mostly clear skies in place. And of course, our sports team, even some members of production will be out across all of Acadiana this evening, getting you the highlights. And I'll have that for you right here on KTC at 1030 for Friday night football. Also happening this weekend, the end of daylight saving time. So uh, make sure to turn those clocks back one hour as you go to bed on the Saturday night. Also that time of year uh, to test the smoke alarms. Of course, the fire department would encourage you to do that. Make sure they're working properly. Properly. Most of us will get an extra hour of sleep. Not everybody, though, because some folks do work uh, through Saturday night, so we'll be thinking of them. And the sun is going to be setting one hour earlier, beginning on Sunday evening at around 518. So just something to keep in mind there. Temperature wise again, mild initially, but cool to chilly by tomorrow morning. Most of us lower 50s, upper 40s though, Ville Platte on northward. And then here we go. Lots of sunshine into our Saturday afternoon, kicking off the weekend on the right side of things for sure. Upper 70s to lower 80s into the afternoon. Most of us starting out lower 50s first thing Sunday morning and then most of us should easily sneak into the lower 80s come Sunday afternoon under generally mostly sunny skies. Again, winds will stay light this weekend at around three to six miles per hour. 50 will be the projected low tonight, at least here in Lafayette. It's going to be a quiet night ahead. So again, not quite as chilly or cold as the past couple of nights, but still probably a light jacket first thing in the morning. Otherwise, tomorrow, lots of sunshine. Really nice looking day. 80 will be the projected high. Should sit at around 75 for the time of year. So a little bit above that, and actually temperatures will continue to run above normal uh, for the better part of that 10-day forecast. I'll show it to you here. 82 into Sunday, mostly sunny sky. Guys, we'll start to mix in some cloud cover as we head into next week. Notice temperatures running above normal low to maybe even mid 80s on a few of these days. Frontal boundary will try to approach uh, late Thursday, early Friday with that. Some rain chances doesn't look uh, doesn't look like a whole lot, at least initially, but that front could kind of get caught up across the area for next weekend. And then the start of the following week could keep us a little bit unsettled with some rain chances sticking with us and slightly cooler temperatures. So we'll definitely remain optimistic optimistic on the rain chances because boy we can use it hopefully uh, get a little bit of a dent in that drought fingers crossed there but of course we'll have more on that longer range pattern for you coming up in the days ahead 50 the projected low tonight near 80 tomorrow afternoon with lots of sunshine well that's a look at weather for now but stay with us we're gonna have more coming up after the break